Good morning, everyone. It is Monday. Yep, we're on Monday. No, we're Tuesday. Payday. It's Tuesday. But good morning. It is Tuesday. Quarter past seven. We was meant to leave about five o'clock. But electric storms last night that I missed. Kept Jonesy awake, so he's leaving late. But we are now literally just heading up Snowdon, Mount Snowdon. Turning it around. Now, I don't think it's one of them two. Might be behind it. I'm not even sure exactly yet, but. We are hiking, we've got Jones and Paul in front. He's trading behind already. They can see what I've got on me, I've got stuck in. I've got a rucksack, loads of water in, some food, bananas, peanuts, and of course, I mean, see, I've got my drone. So, loads of extra weight. I'm a proper unprepared hiker, I've even got my work boots on. Now, I'm not even, I doubt I'll get all the way up there. Very unfit, no training. Oh, oh yeah, Mount Snowden. Lovely little village. Oh, I don't think we're going to make this. Oh, only a couple of minutes in. Oh, no training. No nothing. Just plenty of beer last night. Oh, not this old boy. Oh. That's how you do it, Jonesy. We've only walked up this hill. We've got some nice views already. I mean, this isn't even the start of it, really. Oh, I think Jones said it's like an hour walk to the bottom of the mountain. Ooh. Some ruins there. Jars had one little break. That hill was a bit savage. Right, so we have made it to the start of the path. That was an absolute mission climb that hill. We've only just got to the path, but we have made it to Lambury's path. Lambury's path, and we have just I've all the way down there, so we're still going. Start the path. I don't know if I'm going to be able to make this all the way. I've already been sick once. There we go. Well, it's so slow. I'll get a chance to have a little breather. A chance to have a little breather. Sit down in a few minutes. Just power on past them. But that water down there, that's where we was camped last night. So we had a, had a bit of a trek. All uphill, all unfit. Eight bottles of water like that in the bag. Ooh. That's nice views. Thinking we should have oh, drop the water. Think we should have cheated. Got a train going up the morning. Could have got that ugly, I think. We've got another one coming down now. Yeah, we could have cheated. I wish we cheated. Well, I've got to train to the top and walk to the bottom, that'd be nice. Man! Man! Just having a conversation with the old sheep or lamb or goats or whatever they are. Man! Sounds like a kid crying, doesn't it? Ask me what I did for my holiday. Walking. So we just spoke to some people walking down. 
make sure I'm up the hard way. This is the easy path, apparently. But the other group, they, they come up the hard way and they said some of the parts they was literally climbing, not walking, they was having to climb. So we've got a dog with us as well. I'm glad we took this route. He using that water as a reference point. That water point is where we came from. past eight. We're going for an hour and ten minutes. Some of this, some of the really steep hills are they're, they're like wow and I've got a big bag on but then we get a nice flat bit like we're on now and it just even, evens it out. It's, it gives a bit of a break on your legs. And when you hit the hill again you are ready to go. Train. That's the second one I videoed earlier. It's not even that far so if we was fit and walked faster we could beat that. We do think that's the Snowdonia, Mount Snowden up there. So that's, I think that's the one we're heading to. Unless we get there and it's behind it. Hope not. <laughs> Every little white dot. Sheep. All over it, look. Loads of them. 840. Going for about an hour and a half. Not that some of it's quite bad, but overall it's not as bad as I thought it was going to be. But we are on the amateur path, the easy path. Doesn't look a very safe railway track, does it? It's only a little train that goes over it. So, so this is the highest mountain in Wales, an elevation of 1,085 metres above sea level, and the highest point in the British Isles outside the Scottish Highlands located in Snowdonia National Park in Gwynedd. The peak is also one of the world's most famous landmarks. More than 400,000 people visit the mountain each year. Three facts about Snowdon. Snowdon is located in North Wales, yep. It's the most popular mountain in the UK and it's climbed by around half a million people every year. Yes, yeah, so at 1,085 metres or 3,560 feet. Mount Snowdon was formed by volcanoes around 444 to 488 million years ago. National Park averages eight deaths a year. And most of these occur in a few accident black spots. I assume he's uh, spoken to someone because we thought that was Mount Snowden in front of us. <sighs> Turns out <laughs> it's not. It was that. Apparently it's behind it. I think just have a drone up in the sky. Try to get some shots. But try getting up above the mountain. There's no chance of the wind, obviously. I left at quarter past seven. It's now five to nine. So I dropped my bottle. Look, Doug Daniel. So apparently this is the halfway spot. Sorry about the wind. Jonesy might need that. <laughs> nice breeze, but I'm getting hot. So we've been told we are about 40 minutes away. Oh, the legs are burning. If I can stop, start walking in the fire, literally walking for about 10, 20 seconds in the fires, the burn in the fires is really bad. Oh. Um, one good thing about up here is no rubbish. Barely seen a single thing. There's one dog poo somewhere. 
there's no rubbish. I'm the only way up this mountain at all. But right here, it's no rubbish. You get about half a million people come up here a year, 400,000 to half a million. No rubbish. I'll keep up the good work, people. See, wind's coming and going. Oh, can't wait to get to the top. Dead silent, and that was really, that was really creepy. That was. So you have another rest. They still haven't left there. Now I can only do. I'm at a point. I can only walk like 20 or 30 steps before the tops of my fires absolutely start burning. It's a long way down. A long way up. <laughs> I'm telling you, I'm not going to be able to walk tomorrow. 100% if you're watching this Matt, Matt's my agent, if I'm not in work on the Wednesday then you know what, take his rocks out. Do you want to fall down here? Oh my legs, the wind, oh, Whew. burning. Like, I think. How are you walking down for 30 minutes? 30 minutes? Oh, wow. Wow. <laughs> I could only do about 20 steps at a time now before my legs start burning. I have to keep stopping. You're tired, burn for breath. Yeah. Stop. Yeah. So he's been walking down for half an hour. We've got Tommy's. Yeah, I'll see you. You got up there quick. We see you at the bottom, didn't we? So. That's madness. Oh. But yeah, we're nearly there. I've got to walk under that bridge, I think, and I can see all the people walking up there. Look at that trail going all the way up there. That looks very dodgy. We've already been told it's very windy up there. Twenty-two pounds come up here. Oh, is that? That looks tiny compared to the mountains. Yeah. Pauline's had enough. Train's come up, she's found someone with a spare ticket to get a train down. Alright, so it's just down to me and Jonesy and the dog. We've lost one. One down. One down. Pauline is gone. Pauline is gone. Pauline! <laughs> Seven. It's Eleven o'clock. Oh shit! Yeah. Fucking hell. Whoa. I don't need a toilet. That was close. Fuck me. I'm shaking still from that. Only be another 20 minutes. We're going quite slowly now. Stop, start, stop, start with the yeah, burning the fires. Beautiful views, look at these. North Wales, Snowdonia, Snowdon, Mount Snowdon. Look at that. Whoa. That's the lake we stuck camped on last night. The next set of car park, so that's where we come from. 
we're starting with the other slate. It's stacked up. Let's add to it. Oh, no, not that one. Breeze coming through there, so nice. Oh, so close. <laughs> Nearly there, mate. It's the last bit, isn't it? Yeah. Proper stairs. Yeah. Oh. Need it You know it. That's that light from Volkswagen. Ah. Oh, we're back there yet. Yeah. I didn't think I was going to be able to do this, but I've just managed it. Not quite, mate. Got that little bit to go yet. Last few steps. Oh, you've got the idea. I'm just queuing up to get up here. Finally made it. it. Took us about what four hours. Yeah. That's Last spin round. Oh, no, me out. Snowden. Is up there. <laughs> to complete Mount Snowden, there's only one thing you need. A beer and a lift back down to the bottom. Oh shit.
All right, it's four minutes to 12. We're starting to make our way down. Let's see how long it takes us. Four minutes to 12. So, all right, what a mission that was. I've never done anything that like that. But it's completed, so. All right, see you later. I found a little shop. It wasn't open this morning. Come up here at quarter past seven. They do rolls, drinks. They've even got like, loads of different stuff there. Sea moulds, anti energy, sun lotion, magnets, souvenirs. It's about it's halfway up. It's called the halfway earth, so I've got a cheese and tomato party to start with. This is just taking forever. Oh my god. Okay now. <laughs> I think it's easier to run. It's not hurting my feet so much, I'm not trying to hold myself up the hill.